Today on SNN, we will bring you the latest updates including crews attending state contests, fun within the halls, and sports with Dalton Baldridge, so stay tuned. SHS, you're watching SNN. I'm Tristan. And I'm Hannah. On this day in history, in 1955, Rosa Parks, in violation of segregation laws in Montgomery, Alabama, refused to surrender her bus seat to a white passenger. She was arrested, sparking a 381-day bus boycott led by Martin Luther King Jr. Seniors, it's time to order your senior ads for the yearbook. The yearbook has a limited amount of space available for ads, so the staff would like to plan accordingly so everyone can be included. Please design your ads at www.jostens.com by February 1st. This week's birthdays are Miss Janeway on the 27th, Officer Runfields on the 28th, Coach Skipworth on December 1st, and Miss Warren's birthday on the 2nd. Be sure to wish them all a happy birthday. Class competitions are back. Grade levels will compete in fun games for points to earn a reward at the end of the semester. Be sure to scan the QR code to sign up or look for fly flyers posted around the school. We have several organizations competing in state competition this weekend. We want to send a shout out to the SHS robotics team who are off to compete in Dallas in state competition. They invested countless hours on their robot, right down to the last minute. We also have a team of 13 ag students headed to state LDE competition this weekend. Of the 13 students, seven are from the middle school. They will surely return to state competitions for years to come. Last, our amazing SHS cheer team will leave for state competition soon. We appreciate the squad showcasing their talent and routine for the upcoming, upcoming competition during advisory on Thursday. This will be Cheer's second trip to state. We wish all our state com com competitors the best of luck. The second annual Fine Arts Christmas Showcase is here. Come by on Sunday from 3 to 5 for hot chocolate, an art trail, and face painting. The Carol of Lights will start at 545 in the front lawn with the choir. We hope to see you there. On the 6th, be sure to wear your ugliest Christmas sweater and wear your pajamas and house shoes on the 15th. SHS will be having a long lunch on December 13th. Donate $2 to be eligible. All proceeds go to the elderly in need in our community. It's time for our trivia question. What popular Christmas song was actually written for Thanksgiving? Tristan will have the answer for you after the short break. <laughs> So let's have a little fun with Dalton Baldridge's In the Hall segment. When do you think Christmas season should start? December. Easy. Wrong. After Thanksgiving. August 26th. After Thanksgiving. After Thanksgiving. After Thanksgiving. After Turkey. Right after Thanksgiving's over. Before Thanksgiving. After Thanksgiving. After Thanksgiving. The day after Thanksgiving. <laughs> no. Well, you decorate after Thanksgiving, but you can play Christmas music anytime. Whenever you want it to. November 1st. January. <laughs> what? The day after Thanksgiving. After Halloween. December 1st. This season? Uh, after Thanksgiving. What? October 30th. I think November 5th, because you gotta let, like, Halloween die out a little bit. No. And then, 
Boom, Christmas okay. season. That was a lot of fun. We appreciate all the students who are willing to help us with our In the Hall segment. So, Hannah, do you think Christmas should be celebrated before or after Thanksgiving? After Thanksgiving. Congratulations, everyone. Now it's time to go to our second commercial break. We'll be right back with Dalton Baldridge with sports. This week in sports, there were several basketball games. On Tuesday, the Mustangs played Nazareth, and they won 68-35. to The Phillies also played a game against Estacado, and it was a close game of 50-47. to Congratulations to both teams on their wins. Also, both varsity teams are playing in the Nazareth tournament this weekend, so good luck to both of them. This week, the football district awards were also announced. Many Mustang football players received academic all district honors, honorable mentions, second team all district honors, and first team all district honors. Congratulations to all those who received awards and the whole football team on a great season. Now let's go back to Tristan and Hannah. Congratulations again to the football team this season. That's all we have for today. We'll see you again next week. Thank you for watching. Bye, SHS. Bye, SHS.